Hey everybody, it's Jillian here, and I'm going to try something a little bit different. I am going to try to do a vlog. I'm going to meet up with my friend Josiah at the Dollar Tree, and we're going to go walk around and see what they got. This is my first vlog, so I'm a little nervous, so be kind to me. And I am dog-sitting this lovely lady, Zoe. Say hi. Zoe, there she is. There's Monster and Zoe. And apparently, Monster is obsessed with Zoe's butt. So yeah. Mm hmm You're guilty. There's Suki. Alright. So, I'm gonna head over to the Dollar Tree, and I'll see you guys in just a second. Hey guys, it's me and Josiah here, and Hi. we're gonna do a Dollar Tree vlog. And, um, I'm a little nervous because I've never done that, but he's cool as a cucumber, so Aww. whatever, Josiah. Well, thank you. <laughs> and, um, he's awesome because... He is down to do stuff like this, so I'm glad he's here. Well, thank you. I'm glad All to be a part of it. Let's go. Those are new. It's kind of cute. So they just kind of. I love all these bird things they have. I bought I one of those boxes. That. It has that French little accent to it. Mm -hmm. Cute. That would have been good for a Mother's Day present. What do you like to buy at the Dollar Tree, Josiah? It depends. If I'm coming with a little task or something like that, usually arts and crafts and stuff. Um, and then the occasional snack here and there. So. I actually only need one thing, so let's see how many things I end up with. But I just need hand soap, so we'll see. We'll see. These are cute. I thought that these were pretty cool. They're little LED lights that you can use. Put them out wherever, but they're all—I believe they're battery operated on the back, um, and they come in different things. They have little flowers, green leaves, and dragonflies and stuff. Oh, like it's that. for your garden. That's yeah, cute. I didn't so even notice these it. earlier. See, that's why you, it's good to have two sets of eyes. <laughs> Actually, I'm probably gonna buy some of these. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh, Josiah, look I'm what sorry. you did. Chain reaction. Here we go. All right, I'm gonna get the white ones. Oh look, Father's Day stuff already. Oh well, yeah. Uh -oh. My creative juices are gonna start flowing again. You can never go wrong with burlap. Hmm. <laughs> Get me thinking. I know. I need to, I haven't been I haven't had the time to do a craft. Oh, oh my god. The bears. Oh now I have to find out a oh, there's the present. Oh these are cute. Man, Man cave. cave. My dad has the best toys. <laughs> That's cute. What do you say? Dad's rules. One, the remote is mine. I will Two, turn this car around. <laughs> That's awesome. If they jump off a bridge, will you jump too? I heard that a few times. <laughs> My word is law. <laughs> That's cute. These are cute. They didn't have these before with like the ombre. <gasps> I just bought my Sean's mom a bunch. Oh well. I bought like a chalk, like some of those chalk um, labels. And then I was looking and I couldn't find any dang chalk. Oh really? Yeah. yeah. Those are cute. I broke it off. Super cute. If I needed cards, I would buy these. Actually, oh, they're little glasses. They're little frames. glasses. Is. And there's like vintage telephones and stuff. Oh Those are gosh, cute. Cool. Oh, yeah. I got, I had duct tape with this pattern. Oh really? Yeah, the Dollar Tree kind of yeah use it. The Dollar Tree kind of like shares patterns on different things. Nice. Those are cool. cool. That is so cool for a buff. Yeah, too bad we well, don't have a tiki party planned. I know. I don't need. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Oh yeah, use these for a centerpiece, huh? That's like the perfect size for a centerpiece. Ooh, these are cute. Hmm. Yeah, I was that one caught my eye first, obviously. All things are possible oh, with faith. Thing. That is right down your aisle, Josiah. Oh wow, that is a neat one. 
that would look good in your office. I know, with all the stuff. Uh, Sarah was talking about taking down your um, Adventure Time poster. Mm, yeah, that's not gonna happen. But we'll <laughs> let her think that for now. Now, I know this is a name brand, but is it worth it? Is it worth a dollar for two loads? Hmm. Unless you're traveling. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Don't really think alike. Well, fun fact, when I did my Halloween costume this past year as the Flying Monkey, all I used for my face makeup was... Was one of these? Yep. And I just, I bought a couple of them, crushed them up, and just put it all over my face and it worked all day. Wow. No, I did kind of get all over the place, but... Did you mix it with anything? Mm, no, I had Sarah help me out. What is it? Really good shaving cream. Oh. I don't um, know. Can I use a female shaving cream? <laughs> um, I don't think it would have any adverse effects. I'm just <laughs> guessing. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I need rubbing alcohol. But um, Sean broke a bunch of my makeup because he dropped one of my palettes. Oh no. And supposedly, if you mix it with rubbing alcohol and smash it in there, it fixes it. But I don't really want the green one. You need clear? Yeah. There's clear way oh, in the back over here. It. Yes. I'm like crawling on the floor. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. I was a little too excited there. <laughs> Nothing, Josiah? You don't need anything? No. Just touching your own? Not at the moment. Actually, you know what? In all honesty, I'm surprised that they have cliff bars. Those things are heck of expensive at like. For one, it's more than a dollar? Yeah, I think at like Target you're paying a dollar and change. Oh, that's good. Hmm. So isn't he gonna have never actually eaten? Well, I would on like for a regular basis, probably not, but for more like whenever we go hiking and stuff oh, like okay. that, which your hiking trip will be coming up soon. Yes, hopefully I think so. It might be on birthday party day, but we'll Ooh. You have to outweigh it. What? Have you ever no heard this? way. That one? I have not. You're all too bad I gave it up. I gave it up. Because <laughs> I like really had a problem yeah, with it. Yeah, you had such a problem. Yeah. You drink all the time. <laughs> one glass every like what? Three months? Yeah. <laughs> wow, those look like they came straight out of Bath and Body. I don't buy these because I have so much lotion and body wash from couponing, oh. but a lot of Dollar Tree people haul these and they say they work really good and that they smell really good. They're actually refilled, so let me get one to fill up with both my oh. I'm going to try the apple one. Those are huge. Yeah, I know. I hope they work good because I will keep buying that. Hmm. I have some cute cell phone cases, yeah, but I, was gonna say, I, that design. I bet they're really, really thin. And I literally, I'm not lying, I just saw one on clearance exactly like this with that same texture and everything at Target on clearance for like seven bucks. Nice. Yeah. Nice. So for them to have it here for a dollar. That's awesome. That is pretty awesome. Except they always only have iPhone ones. Well, I guess, yeah, you're the iPhone junkie over here. I am. In good containers. Look, they actually have um, cake takers. Are you trying to throw a hint to me there? Well, you don't you bake? I do bake quite a yeah. bit. So. Mm, I'm like Josiah, buy something, so I'm not the only one <laughs> wasting my money. Not wasting, but spending it. Look, they got your owls too. Oh, that one's cuter than the one I bought. I actually bought this one. Thank you. I actually bought that one and I oh, thought it was kind of cool. cute. What did you do with it? I put it on a makeup case thing I made, but oh, nice. that's way cuter. Let's see how it looks like. Oh my god, now I'm mad. Oh, look at oh the my god. bubble. That's so cute. That is super neat. I don't need it, I'm not buying it, but <laughs> it's cute. Whoa, those are huge. I should buy that for Kate. She's always making popcorn and she can oh. never find 
a thing for popcorn. I'm gonna buy that for her. Perfect. And doubles. Nice. Because we didn't buy a, bring a cart. These, I saw these. I, I know. This one has an air bubble. But I saw those and I thought that would be so neat to do. You could do so much with that. And is that what you were talking about? Had they had ones that had that and they had a cute lid and then they had like a colorful straw. Really? And I haven't seen them since and I should have bought one. And see, and it's funny because that's what's really neat. Stuff, yeah, mason jar and chalkboard, just yeah. totally in. Well, that's what I did with those that, uh, those arrangements I made. Those yeah, chalkboards. that was that was really cute. Oh, I wonder if this is any good. Oh. Well, I'm kind of scared, but that would be awesome if it is. You're buying something. I am. The reason being is we made those paninis today and I didn't have a little pizza cutter to cut them up. Oh, so you're going to leave it at work? Yep. Yeah. That one looks more, uh, oh. hearty, <laughs> I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Substantial. There you go. Hot dog cutter. Oh my gosh. Come on, America. How lazy can you be? Why would you cut a hot dog? For little kids, because I think, uh, don't they kind of choke on them? Yeah, 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 I can see that. Yeah. So, now, I've been looking for these at, like, whenever I go to Target for a quick thing and all that stuff, and they don't even sell them anymore. Not that I've seen. What? And now they have them here at the dollar store. Cool. What do you want them for, like, when you're... Well, no, I would put, leave it in the trap. So oh. that way, if I ever go shopping and stuff like that. Oh, I'm that, always all that's a good Target idea. And I was like, oh, I can't get that because I don't have anything to keep it cool. So if you basically, if you put something cold in there, it stays cold? cold. Uh-huh. Or a pot, likewise. Oh, um, I'm going to buy one, too. Let's see? Oh, my gosh. Good ideas over here. I feel right. like some heavy-duty shoes, though. And the Betty Crocker stuff is pretty good. Yeah. Oh, for a dollar. Oh, that's ingenious. A little crazy. Oh, oh, and it catches it in a little... Oh. But that's a little too fine for me, more oh. like zest and whatnot. Yeah, but if it was like an actual grater grater, mm -hmm. that would be I bought one of these to put on my nightstand to hold all my junk. Is it actual? Oh yeah, because I, I don't know what I was, I was messing around and I put a magnet on it and it actually holds Special. a magnet. Yeah. Hmm. Don't ask me why I was doing that, but I did. Okay, so I made the wrong decision to, I did a... Um, Oh, uh, what was it? I helped out for a bake sale at the church not too long ago, and there was, um, I ended up making two apple pies, and I was like, oh, I can just go ahead and, the two glass plates that I made them in, I was going to go ahead and sell them. Well, they ended up um, selling the pie with the plate and all, Oh. but if I would have known that they would have had dollar ones here, I would have just made the pie. So that. you lost your good pie plates? Well, they were all right, and that's why I was okay with letting them go, but... Yeah. Glass is a little bit more expensive than dollar plates. Yeah. What is that? An oven? They have so many weird trinkets here. Is it, oh, it's for the microwave. Oh. Microwaving eggs. Psh. <laughs> <laughs> you know what is actually really good and it works basically the same as the original stuff? What's that? Let's see if I can find them. They're like magic eraser dupes. These guys. Oh, really? Yes, these work really, really good. Actually, I'm going to take one of those out that you mentioned it because we have crayon and marker on the tables at work. Oh. <laughs> Tough wipes. Barbecue and grill. Actually, I'm going to take it apart. Look, see what you do to me. Oh my I goodness, I'm a bad influence. <laughs> well, I'm thinking because I actually just use wet paper towel, but they kind of dry out real easily. <laughs> and I'm scared, like, I'm going to get them real hot and throw them into the... So, do you think this works better than just scrubbing it with the bristles? Does it clean well, better? No, I would go ahead and scrub with the bristles, but the thing about the bristles is whenever you use them on a grill, sometimes it leaves those metal shavings on there oh, for the bristles then and then even the little scrub brushes. So, by wiping it down afterwards with one of these, you're potentially saving yourself from ingesting any kind of metal or whatever in your meats and stuff. Oh, so. okay. Well, I'm going to buy them too. Take, 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 take. 